Hi everyone, I'm Lawrence, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the two awful That's So Raven games the GBA got. That's So Raven is unique, but boring in my opinion. The game is split into five sections, and in each, you either collect something or search for someone. There are people that hurt you by running you over with a mop or throwing muffins or books at you. You can get caught by the hallway guard and if you don't have enough or if you run out of collected hallway passes, you have to start the level all over if you get caught by the hallway guard. And the level themselves are pretty boring. In one for example you have to roam the school, talk to everyone. And from everyone you have to gather 7 students that will like to take part in your ride. It's very boring. There are also some minigames but unfortunately this one with this chicken is the best. This is the pinnacle of the game in my opinion. It's the most fun you get out of all of the game. In rest other minigames are... Eh. The game is also lazy, it uses the same sprites and the same backgrounds in multiple levels. And overall, the gameplay is boring and even if it tries to be varied and unique by adding some very lousy minigames, it's just bad. The game is just bad. It's playable, but very dull and bad. And that's a Raven 2 supernatural style is even worse. It's a platformer, but with the mechanics butchered. Almost all jumps are frustrating. Raven doesn't jump very far or very high and she doesn't always reach the platform. Also hit detection needs glasses because it's off. You have to collect all pieces of a vision and get out of a level. And they are so easily missable that you'll be wandering these levels over and over just to find the missing piece. If you ever see this game, avoid it. It's frustrating and very bad.